Kalu. Merry Christmas! Yay! Everyone in Kalu's family is getting ready to celebrate Christmas. Grandma and Grandpa are visiting. So is Aunt Poppy, who has brought along Balthazar, her big cat. Meow. Grandma and Mummy are baking cookies in the shape of stars. Mm. Balthazar sits in a corner of the kitchen, hoping for a treat. Meow. In the living room, Aunt Poppy and Grandpa are singing Christmas songs. Kalo would like to sing along, but he's having trouble sitting still. Is tonight Christmas Eve? Kalo asked Daddy for the hundredth time. Before going to bed, Kalo puts three cookies and a glass of milk on a table in the living room. Wow! These are for Santa Claus, Kalo whispers to Rosie. Kalo is having a lot of trouble falling asleep. He has been waiting so long for this night to arrive. Finally, he sleeps, dreaming of all the presents Santa will bring him. In the middle of the night, a strange noise awakens Kalu. It's coming from the living room. Kalu is sure it's Santa. Kalu gets out of bed and tiptoes downstairs, being careful not to make any noise. He especially doesn't want to wake up Rosie. Kalu's heart is beating very fast. The glass of milk is almost empty and the cookies are gone. Santa must be nearby, Kalu thinks. Kalu is very excited but walks cautiously through the living room. Suddenly, he sees two bright green eyes staring at him. Balthazar, what are you doing there? Kalu scolds Aunt Poppy's cat. Balthazar is sitting pushing the cookies around on the floor. His whiskers are still white from drinking the milk. Kalu goes back to bed, a little disappointed because he wished he had seen Santa. <sighs> Balthazar follows him, purring happily. Kalu is the first one awake on Christmas morning. He runs downstairs. Rosie, Rosie, come see! Kalu shouts when he sees all the presents Santa has left under the Christmas tree. There is something for everyone, even for that naughty cat, Balthazar. Meow. The end. Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! Hi, kids! Did you have fun watching this video? Then like and subscribe for more!